The Control Pro provides powerful control of Pro Tools panning and switch commands with the Pro Control Edit Pack. This video shows how to use the Edit Pack with Pro Tools 11 and later. Edit Pack features dual touch sensitive joystick panners, switch commands, keyboard, and trackball. V Control Pro connects Edit Pack alongside any other surfaces. In this video, we use it with a C24 surface. Detailed setup instructions can be seen at the end of this video showing how to configure Pro Tools MIDI peripherals and connect to V Control Pro's fast virtual MIDI ports. Edit Pack's dual panner sections can be used for stereo panning or surround panning. The two sections can pan two separate channels simultaneously, or pan the left and right channels of a stereo track. In addition to the joystick, you can control several panner and track parameters with the encoder knob, front pan, rear pan, front to rear pan, center percent, LFE, front divergence, rear divergence, front to rear divergence, track volume, and track mute. To select a channel for pan control, use channel select mode. Pro Tools highlights the track currently selected. Now you can select the main output for pan control, or select a send channel to be panned. Edit Pack's touch sensitive joysticks integrate with Pro Tools automation. The panner protocol does not support the auto button, so select an automation mode in the pan window. V Control Pro uses the auto button to temporarily disable the joystick touch control and initialize the joystick position. Now when you touch the joystick, Pro Tools will start recording the automation. You can pan a stereo track with one panner section. Pro Tools provides a link function so that both channels will be panned. For unlinked panning, you can switch the panner section to control the left or right side using the solo button. You can also use the control modifier to temporarily unlink the panning. You can also use both panner sections for stereo panning. Select the same stereo track for both panner sections and assign the second panner to the right channel. V Control Pro lets you link the two panner sections when panning two different channels. Use the Link Panners button to link them. Tap the Link Panners button again for inverted linking. Edit Pack provides several buttons assigned to Pro Tools commands to accelerate your workflow. The top label command is assigned when the main mode is active. Tap the button again for Alt mode to use commands labeled below the button. You can see all the commands available at this website page. To set up the edit pack, open V Control Pro Setups window. Click on Add New, select Ethernet device. After it locates the edit pack on the network, select it and click Add. Now launch Pro Tools to set it up. Before opening a session, open the Peripherals window. Select the MIDI Controllers tab. Set up two surround panner controllers using the VPAN1 and VPAN2 MIDI ports. and set up at least one Huey controller for the V-Control MIDI port. Setup is now complete. Now you can open a Pro Tools session and start using your edit pack.